In this video, we're going to take a look at a legal problem called middle of the linked list. So given a non-empty uh, singly linked list with the head node head return a middle node of a linked list. So if there are two middle nodes, return the second middle nodes, um, right? So in this case, uh, here you can see we have an example of a linked list where we have a node 3, which is the middle node of the linked list. And uh, in this case, we just have to return no three, right? So here you can see we have another example where we have two middle nodes, right? Just like what we talked about, two middle nodes. Then we're just gonna return a second node, second middle node, in this case, no four. So let's say we only have two nodes, right? So let's say we only have uh, node one and node two. So node one and node two. So in this case, we're, we're also gonna return because in this case, they're all middle nodes. So we're just going to return the second node. So in this case, we're just returning the node two, right? So how can we solve this problem? So to solve the problem, just like how we did it in the linked list cycle, right? We're going to have a slow pointer and a fast pointer. But let's talk about the uh, let's talk about how we can solve this problem without the pointers, right? So what we can do this what we can do is we can first um, do a one do a one pass to find the length of the list. And then once we find the length of the list, which in this case is going to be uh, six, right? So there are six nodes. Then we're going to get six divided by two, which is three. So now we just have to move three times. One, two, three, we should get to node four, and we just have to return node four, right? So that's one way. And the other way is we can use the fast and slow pointers, just like how we did it in the linked list cycle. And uh, the idea is this. We're going to have a slow pointer and a fast pointer, and they all both start at the same position, right, which is in the, the head node. Then the slow pointer is going to move one node at a time, and the, the fast pointer is going to move two nodes at a time. At the end, we're going to get fast pointer move to the end of the link list, and the slow pointer is actually going to uh, move to the middle of the link list. So when the, so let me give you an example. Like when the slow pointer is here, the fast pointer is also here, but when the slow pointer is here, right, the fast pointer is now here, right? Because the fast pointer moved two nodes at a time. Now, when the slow pointer is here, the fast pointer is now at node five. Now the slow pointer is at four, the fast pointer now is at null. So now we can just return the, the node that the slow pointer is pointing to, right? So now let's try to do this in code. First, we're gonna define our base case, right? Once we define our base case, where the head.nest, if the head.nest is null, right, then we that means that there, there's only one node, we can just return head. Then we're gonna define our slow and fast pointers. So once we have slow and fast pointer defined, we're going to um, traverse the list. And uh, we're gonna traverse the list until we have the fast pointer is equal to null. Then we're going to return the head, uh, sorry, yeah, the, the slow pointer, right? So we're gonna return this, the, the node that the slow pointer is pointing to. So now let's try to do this. So first we're gonna say if head.nest is equal to null, we can just return head, right? And uh, because it, the question says that, um, in this case we're given a non-empty singly linked list, right? So in this case we're assuming that there could be a situation where we only have one node in the linked list, then we're gonna return the head. Now we're going to define our slow as well as our fast, which they all starts at the head. Then we're going to traverse the list. So while fast does not equal null and fast.nest does not equal null, right? Because we're traversing two nodes at a time. We know the fast pointer is going to be faster than the slow pointer. And we also gonna we also know that uh, fast pointer is gonna move two nodes at, two nodes at a time. So we want to make sure that the current node is not empty is not null, and the current dot nest is not null. So then we're gonna get fast is equal to fast dot nest dot nest, and slow is equal to slow dot nest. So now we're moving at two two different uh, two different speed, um, two different stable speed. Then we're going to get. Um, to a situation where the fast is equal to null, then we want to make sure we return slow, right? So in this, in this case, we're returning the node that the slow pointer is pointing to. So now if we were to run the code and submit, and here you can see we have our success. So this is how we solve this problem in one pass. And again, the time complexity is linear 
uh, big, o, big O of N, where N is going to be the number of nodes um, in the linked list, right? So there we have it, and thank you for watching.